What's going on YouTube? How y'all doing out there? Man, it's your boy Tank again, and I'm coming at y'all today from my hotel room down here in Mesquite, Texas. guys so today is the today is sunday uh the day after the jordan 5 uh stealth 2.0 drop and uh with me being in with me being in mesquite texas uh i wasn't able to get any pairs uh, through the raffle because i didn't switch my name over when when i did my raffles i mean of course i hit for a couple of them my the guy I usually get my shoes through um, was on vacation, so it is what it is, you know what I mean? But my wife's apps didn't hit for nothing. Uh, all the pairs that I hit for were four pairs, and three of my accounts hit for, uh, for raffles, and it was all in my name, so uh, they wouldn't let my wife pick them up because she's not me. But I went ahead and put that footwork in. So I'm down here in Mesquite, Texas. Uh, I got up early in the morning. Went to the mall here. Y'all already know, like the day after the pickup time, um, it's first come, first serve. So I was able to pick up a uh, three pair. And I, I would have been able to get a fourth pair, but a fight broke out. And yeah, like I don't, yeah, after the fight broke out, man, I paid for my last sneaker and I, I got up out of there. I'll stick around for stuff like that. But uh, let's go ahead and get into these sneakers, all right? So these sneakers, like, I I thought they weren't gonna sell out. I, I'm pretty sure a lot of people thought like these wasn't gonna sell out. These were not even, these was not even on a lot of people radars, you know what I mean? And I was just kind of shocked that these sold out like that. You go ahead and do a quick review on this sneaker. Uh, this is a size 11, not a personal pair. But that's cool though, because like this is not on my cop list. Uh, I, I can go without this one. Uh, now next week when the Raging Bulls come out, I'm using all my accounts to hit for my pair. I mean, yeah, yeah, my size, my pair. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I don't care about nothing else. I mean, if I get extra pairs, I get extra pairs, but I really want my 10 and a half. All right, so I was able to, to get a size 11, all right? Size seven, and I think y'all seeing this one. This one is a size eight, right? Now, these are already sold. Um, uh, uh, like the main three people that usually buy from me, I, I really wanted to make sure I took care of them because this would be my last resale sneaker. Yeah, reselling, it, it, it been fun, but yeah, I, I, I'm over it, you know what I mean? Let's go ahead and read this label. Uh, <clears throat> label reads, Air Jordan 5 Retro, white hyper royal stealth. Uh, these these ran me 190, it was like 205 and some change after tax, with tax. Uh, as you can see, that is the, the quality stamp uh, right there in the inside. Regular tissue paper, none. I mean, it got the little splatter effect, but I mean, nothing, nothing spectacular, right? All right, guys, here we go. We have the Jordan Five Retro Hyper Royal uh, Stealth, and uh, you know, I'm gonna go ahead and pull this thing out aside. So, now my opinion on this man, like the leather on here is, is okay. The leather on here is really tumble. It do have that tumble effect on there. As you guys can see, all the way around, the white on this sneaker is just white. It's, it's really white, really white. You do have that 3M tongue with the Hyper Road Jumpman right there on the tongue. And then on the back of the tongue, 
you do have the Air Jordan right there and the Jordan logo on the back. Like the sock liner on here is also that Hyper Royal Blue. Huh, okay, the netting on here, let me see. Is, can you pull this? Okay, you can't pull it. But the netting on here is really soft and it is that translucent clear white with the uh, with the white background on there, right? Man, you know what? Like, I'm not going, eh, nah, nah, nah. The leather on here is hard. <laughs> Uh, I got the white laces. These did not come with an extra set of laces. Let me double check. But it, it would have been nice if these did come with an extra set of laces. You got that white on the top. You know what I mean? It's very tumbled. Uh, you got the netting cage right there on the tongue too. And then when you move on down to the shoe, it looks like that's, that's, that's kind of, uh, how come they ain't say gray on there? On the label, it don't even mention a gray right there. It, it, like, the, the gray itself is... I wouldn't even say... I wouldn't even say that's wolf gray. I, I'll probably say, like, that's a shadow gray. You know what I mean? Kind of like the shadow ones. Like, that gray right there resembles the shadow ones gray right there. Then you got your shark teeth. Your shark teeth is black with with just like a little splatter of uh, hyper hyper blue. Then you also have your lace lock, clear translucent. What really stands out about the Jordan 5 is the translucent clear bottom with the with the hyper blue jump man showing through it. All in all, man, like I probably, like this shoe was not on my radar to pick up. So I'll probably get this sneaker um, a five out of 10. This is not a bad sneaker. Um, like you guys wanted to cop this one. I mean, it was a bit. It was a pretty big gr. Uh, like a lot of us was kind of shocked that these dropped and sold out as fast as they did. Uh, I really thought these was gonna be sitting around for a couple days before they sold out. But hey, I was wrong. Now looking at the gr. Wait, wait a minute. How, wait, first of all, you're not gonna speed past that like you didn't just say what you just said. Compared to the man shoe, it's the same shoe. Like nothing nothing really changes on the Jordan 5s uh, when it comes to the man's and the GR release. Nothing. Same shoe, you know what I mean? Yeah, same shoe. And don't forget to comment down below and like and subscribe if you're not already subscribed to my channel. I really do appreciate it. And comment down below if you guys uh, hit for a pair of these. Uh, did y'all want them? I mean, was they was they a shoe you was looking to pick up for the year, um, or you could have just went without them? Now I don't really see any factory flaws on these for it to be a big release. Like there's no, there's really no glue marks or or anything, man. Like they they really did their thing with these. I'm gonna go ahead and end this video right here. I just wanted to make this a short and sweet video so I can get it edited and, and posted and so I can continue working on my other videos that I got going on. And I can't leave without saying, we all got dreams. All our dreams come true. But only if we got the courage to pursue them. This your boy Tank, man. I love y'all, man. I'm out.